Working with Eric Ron has been incredible. He and I had some writing sessions and those writing sessions were extremely fruitful. I wanted someone that would understand the music and not just say you're a rock band with a hip hop vibe and let's beat Rage Against the Machine at their own game. He didn't give me that vibe at all. He wanted to create a rock record with a hip hop ethos. Those were the exact words that we used when I met him and that's exactly what came out of the writing sessions. It's been a nice focused journey. It's something very fresh. It's not quite rap, it's not quite rock, it's not quite reggae, it's everything in between. So I've had a blast trying to give it its own space and make it fluid at the same time. Eric has pretty much been involved in this record from start to finish. He just knows how to, to pull the best out of you. I know it's lower, so don't get quiet with it. Really dig into those words. Saying the right things in the moment to keep you pushing. Beautiful. All right, now bring the swagger. They were really prepared. They had a lot of material coming in, and it wasn't like tearing it down and building it back up. It was just taking what they had and enhancing it. I was here for a few hours. I had brought a beat that I cooked up, and he immediately knew how to take it to the next next point. I think I was a little off there, yeah? Something like that could be cool, but in that tone, there's something underneath that kind of oh, carries it a little bit. Gotcha. It all meshed together so well. It's been an extremely efficient experience. And how can I speak life when all I see is death? We were here for two months and you would think that's a long time, especially in the modern era where people are writing records in a week. Every day, something productive came out of it and we were able to get closer to actually completing this thing. Having this amount of time enabled us to be creative but not have to force creativity either. A lot of times when you start forcing your creativity, I feel like you hit a wall. It has been nice to be able to just call it a day when you feel like something's not right. At Eric's place, you know, we stay here, we sleep here, we're immersed in this record like we live in the same place we write the record so you don't really get away from it we have a piece of art here that is real and people are gonna get it and hopefully be able to visualize it a lot of that has to do with how good Eric is if I was gonna intro this album to someone I would tell them to strap their seatbelts in and get ready for a ride because it's a really fun powerful journey Run!